Hey everybody, welcome back to Sportsnet Central Montreal. Now before we break out the champagne and say goodbye to another year, we're going to revisit some of the biggest local stories on the Montreal sports scenes. Names and events that have made headlines in our great city, as Sean Coleman reports. 2014 was the year of the makeover for Montreal sports. It started with new head coaches. The Alouettes brought in Mr. Optimistic. He kept smiling even as the Alouettes went through quarterback after quarterback after quarterback after quarterback. An incredible late season run nearly had them in the Grey Cup. Too bad Hamilton's Brandon Banks had other plans. Little to smile about this season for the impact. On their third coach in three seasons, frustrations were high with players and owner alike. The arrival of an Argentinian superstar, however, should give fans hope for next season. It was a different story for the Habs. Fans started planning Stanley Cup parades in the spring after Michel Therrien's squad upset the Bruins. Sadly, Chris Kreider crashed the party. 2014 was also a year of breakouts. A dazzling tennis star reached the finals of her first major. And David knocked off Goliath in university football before winning the Vanier Cup. As young stars welcomed the spotlight, the older generation said goodbye. Veterans packed their bags and left for the warm beaches of Italy or the not so warm beaches of Buffalo. Unpopular stars were traded away. Some legends had their jersey retired. Others laid to rest. 2015 promises big things for Montrealers. Just remember, bring a program so you can recognize all the new faces.